all right yo what is up guys it's me mason and welcome back to another video on the channel in today's video i am here on skyr mc and in today's video we're going to be checking out the skyr mc server make sure that you guys do come check out the server as i am going to be uploading on here some more and pretty much if you guys do end up enjoying today's video where we check out all of the custom features here on the survival realm here on skyr mc make sure that you guys do go ahead and actually drop a like on today's video let's go for 169 likes also make sure that you guys do go ahead and subscribe to the channel because i actually want to hit 12.5 thousand subscribers by the end of the year also make sure that you guys do turn on post notifications comment something nice down below and in today's video we might be starred by a guest mickey mc so you guys will see him later on in the video and anyways guys let's go ahead and get into today's video but before that make sure you guys comment something nice down below turn on post notifications and the server ip will be in the top center of your screen throughout the entire video play.sky or Dot uk and it's down below in the description as well for you guys to copy and paste anyways we're gonna go ahead and get into today's video i'll see you guys in the video peace out okay guys so as soon as you guys do spawn into the server you guys will actually see that there's the warps wilderness and bow npcs and then right here it says welcome to the survival server type slash commands to view all of the basic commands you could return to the hub by typing slash hub at any time so if we do such commands then we could teleport to the command help we're gonna go ahead and check that out really quick so basically slash spawn teleports you to the spawn slash warp opens the survival warp menu slash set home and then the name sets the warp uh and then such homes allows you to choose which home to warp to such vote allows you to open the vote menu and then such rtp teleports you to a random location in the wilderness such tpa allows you to send a tp request and then such trust grants a player access to build on your claim untrust revokes a player's access to build on your claim abandoned claim abandons the claim you're standing in give pet transfers the ownership of one of your pets that you have to like someone else so let's say i wanted to transfer it to the owner i could do that um, and then AH is the auction house, which you guys can purchase stuff from other people. AH sell and then the price allows you to put your own stuff up on the auction house. AH cancel allows you to cancel all your listings. And then so shop is the survival shop, which basically is the shop GUI allows you to pretty much sell and buy stuff, which is pretty cool. Um, and then right here is the warps wilderness and boat like i already said we're gonna click on this check this out there's the spawn leaderboard crates shop enchantment room nether command help and end and then right here teleports you to the wilderness as you can see set home all right i'm just gonna set a home there just in case there's a timer that i have to wait and then vote actually gives you crate keys so you guys can actually vote on these three different links which is what i'm going to do in a couple of minutes and then over here there are some crates so left click to preview and right click with the key to use so we're gonna left click this this is basically all of the stuff that you can win from the vote key this is all the stuff that you guys can win from the elite key which is a ton of different stuff and then this is all the stuff that you could win from the legendary key so overall a ton of insane stuff that you guys can actually win from all of these keys which is pretty pretty cool and then if we come over here this is actually the leaderboard so we could see that it's basically just an achievement leaderboard now it looks like the this shows the top 14 people 14th place has 18 achievements and first place has 48 which is kind of crazy and then there's a survival sign right here and then out there i'm assuming is some wilderness area if we come down here though let's check out what this actually is it looks like there's a shopkeeper over here so it looks like okay so there's actually some ores sitting on the table which is pretty cool and then there's actually some zombies over there with armor on and then you right click this and it just opens up the shop gui so basically it's just the shopkeeper which is the same thing as doing such shop and then such spawn will tell Teleport you to the spawn is what that says right there um, so basically I think what I'm gonna go ahead and do now is ask for some crate keys like I just did in the chat and go ahead and open some keys for you guys I do actually want to go ahead and vote as well so I'm gonna go ahead and vote on all three of the links and then I'll bring you guys back in just a couple of minutes all right guys so i actually do have some crate keys i got my three vote keys from the or from the uh, voting and then i got three elite keys from the owner and five legendary keys from the owner so we're gonna go ahead and open up the first vote key we're gonna see what we actually get from this crate key so it looks like we actually got uh i'm guessing that's kind of like glitch but basically it's just giving me my head which is pretty cool so there we go we did actually get my head which is pretty good so now the next thing that we're actually gonna get let's see what we actually win and that looks like we won it looks like we won 32 ice blocks which is not really that good but i mean it's still something 
All right, let's see what we win from this last crate key. It looks like I won another one of my heads. Okay, so that's some pretty good stuff that we got right there. I have two of my heads now, which is pretty cool. And all right, so we're gonna see what we get from this elite key. Uh, we got 64 purple blocks. Okay, so let's do a shop and let's see if we could actually sell these. I'm not entirely sure. It doesn't look like we can. Uh, let's see. So yeah, it doesn't look like we can actually sell those. Let's see if we can sell the ice. Yes, we can actually sell the ice. All right, so we got rid of that. And then the purple blocks, obviously, like I said, we can't actually sell. So we just have to keep opening these keys. Let's see what we get from the next elite key, though. We might actually make a purple block house, that means, because of the stuff that we got. And then we can put some magma blocks around our house to try and keep the mobs away because they can't walk on it or anything like that so that might actually be a good idea we got an efficiency three diamond axe from this last one right here so pretty good stuff out of those keys now we're going to open up the best crate keys the legendary keys let's see what we get end up getting from this first one and we got 10 lapis which is honestly not really the best in my personal opinion i don't really think it's that good but you guys might have a different opinion on the uh, what lapis basically is like if you guys think that it's good or anything all right we got two beehives we might be able to use those in the future for some bees and we can maybe make a bee farm and get some honey and stuff like that. I got a trident from the next crate key, which is actually pretty pretty good, I would say. All right, now we're going to open this next crate key. Let's see what we actually win. And it looks like we won a music disc, which is the blocks music disc C418. And then from this very final legendary crate key, it looks like we won two bee nests. So, okay, so we got some stuff for bees. So definitely some interesting stuff, though. So let's see how much we can actually sell this lapis for. Oh, wow. So a stack of it goes for 300. So it looks like we obviously only have 10, but that's still 46.875 stars that we just got from that. So we did get a decent amount of stuff. Now, basically, some other things that I want to check out is I actually want to do such warps or go to right here. And I actually want to go ahead and I want to check out the enchantment room. And then once we get out of the enchantment room, we're going to check out the nether in the end. So this is the enchantment room. It's actually from right here. I didn't even know that that's where it was, but basically it's just a little enchantment enchantment table area which is pretty cool you guys don't have to make your own enchantment table you could just use the one that is provided to you at the spawn of the server and then if we come back up here we're going to go back to the warp npc also it looks like there's a cool little turtle area right there which is pretty cool and then uh you can see mickey mc is right here as well so actually what we're going to do now is go ahead to the nether and we're going to go check out the nether see what the nether actually looks like let's see what the nether is looking like here um so it looks like it teepeed us to like a spawn location and this is kind of different because i don't normally go to the nether so we'll have to like figure all of that stuff out later so i'm not sure i'm guessing we don't have any kits that means so we're gonna have to start out from scratch but we're gonna go to the spawn and then we are actually going to go ahead and check out the end and then after we check out the end we're gonna go ahead and head on over to doing some other stuff so let's see as soon as we spawn into the end it looks like okay so we spawn right by the portal we can actually respawn the ender dragon if we wanted to but i don't think i'm going to be doing that so i think what i'm going to go ahead and do is i'm going to go to such spawn and then okay so for some reason i'm like stuck in the end or something uh, that's kind of weird. I'm not entirely sure how to do that. Um, okay, well, uh, I'll figure that out. All right, guys. So I actually made it out of the end successfully. I had to go through a bit of, I don't even know what to call that, a bit of troubles, I'd say. So it was kind of weird. I'm not entirely sure. But basically, I think in the next video, I'm actually going to be building a house alongside Mickey. He's actually recording his video, which is basically the same exact thing as this one. So make sure you guys go check that out. But pretty much, I think what I'm going to end up doing, like I said, is basically I am going to probably be making a house with Mickey as soon as we actually do go ahead and start recording the second video. So I will bring you guys back with another video very, very soon. But basically, we are actually going to be ending off today's video here. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure that you guys do. First of all, go ahead and drop a like on today's video. If we could actually hit 150 likes, that would be amazing. I definitely think that we could hit that. It's possible. We're hitting like 
every other video we are hitting the 169 likes goal so i want to try and lower it a little bit and see if we could hit 150 every time so make sure you guys do that also make sure you guys go ahead and also come check out the server play.skyermc or play.skyer.uk sorry the server is called skyermc the ip is also down below in the description you guys could copy and paste it into your server address uh, list basically also you guys can join this on bedrock the link to how to join the server on bedrock or all the information for that is also down below in the description so this server is very very fun you guys should definitely come check it out and i will be playing on here more often anyways guys i'm gonna go ahead and i'll see you guys very very soon with another video make sure you guys subscribe so i can hit 12.5k subs comment something nice down below and i will see you guys in the next video on here peace out